Welcome back to... Do you like... Um... Uh, do, do you like random checks on... Uh... If... If you can hit guys who are more powerful than you? I'm Civvy. And that's what we're doing today. Again. I think last time I got her stuck on something. No, I'm pretty sure I said... Heal, thank you. Now we're gonna do this. Because... What, what am I, what am I supposed to do here? I lost her. Okay, at the very least we're gonna quick save so that I don't have to see that again. All right, let's see if we can find her. There she is. I guess we're gonna chip damage. That's what we're doing today. I don't recall this fight. Oh, hi. You're right there, apparently. go finally oh my god that's so stupid give me your lightsaber i didn't think there were any left what uh, colony of the mid rim, almost halfway, but then it wasn't there anymore. The whole planet was wiped out. Mm, maybe she knows? Uh, if they're all force sensitive, maybe they saw something through the force. See through the force? They came to see on a higher plane. The whole force thing makes me nervous. It's so kind of rare. I'm not sure. It'd be tricky. Killing one. Uh, is she going to be all right? She is a threat to us. I won't harm her. I am not asking that she be harmed or interrogated, but she is of the Sith, and she has attacked us once. I just she wanted to install to things on my stupid on robot. Ship. She has shiny lips. Just wanted to install shit on my lightsaber. 
Well, we might as well talk to her now. You mean the blind Sith? Uh, do not mate with her, whatever you may feel. Whatever urges, do not let them control you. Such, such a union would, ble would free... What? Just because I saved her doesn't mean I'm going to charge up her loading ramp. Her presence here is a threat to us. To you, do not estimate her or her loyalty. Maybe she can help us find the lost Jedi. Perhaps. What do you make of that? Seems strange, a force for... <laughs> yep. Uh, maybe we'll discuss this more. Never mind. Okay. So I just need a lens now. Still the processor. Um. All right. I just came back here to do that. So now let's leave. Sentinel, eh? Sure, let's take her. Why not? What could go wrong? Okay. Peace. You alright? Ask if you're alright. Who hurt you? How'd you find me? Who sent you? Where can I find your master? Uh, ready? Okay, I'll be going. Uh, I believe you can be saved. What do you mean? Remember very little... Uh, tell me about your homeworld. Oh, yay. Uh, how is it destroyed? Planet was not destroyed. Dead in space. If your home were, uh, how'd you survive? Everything suddenly went silent. Uh, you were the only survivor. He made you see. Why'd he show you? How did he destroy it? Why? Uh, why did the Jedi meet there? He attacked because the Jedi were there? Hmm. Alright, I'll be going. Cool. Alright, let's level her up. Oh, I'm like high light side. All right, what's she good at? Stealth? Awareness. And she knows computer use and demolitions. Sure, we'll pump computer use. Why not? Okay, she's already going on the two-handed or the two-weapon feet, so we'll do that. Obviously, first choice is always healing if we can take it. What she got? Dex. Uh, not spot it. Dex it is. Okay. Skills. <laughs> Do you have... Yeah. Push, whirlwind, throw lightsaber. V 
feats. Now you can learn the final level of that. Powers. Choke. More lightning equals more better. She knows. Lightsaber form. Cool. All right, let's equip her with stuff. She's currently wearing absolutely nothing. Great. Just 5 to 17 with just her hands. Um, I guess I'll just let her punch. She's good at it. All right. Let's continue on. That was annoying. All I wanted to do was put the stupid HK part in my droid. But all right. What do you want now? Oh, it's this person. Gotta go. All right. Let's go have a talk. Do you actually believe a Jedi would return here? After all they've done to us? They wouldn't dare. They certainly would. Well, you remember how they were. Always so superior, so arrogant, and never lending a hand when we really needed them. I still don't believe it. You should. My cousin's friend, he used to tend the gardens around the Enclave. He swears he saw a Jedi in Kunda. Could be hiding anywhere. Well, I hope it's true. I hear there's a bounty on them, and we could certainly use the money. Unless somebody beats you to it. I'm right here. Welcome to Kunda. You're a salvager, right? You'll need to see Administrator Adare to get access to the ruins. If you need to... Why does everyone think I'm a salvager? The only heavily armed people that visit us are either salvages or mercenaries. And you don't look quite gritty enough to be a mercenary. Fair. Where is he? Her office is directly behind this room. You really can't miss it. She can see you now if you like. Uh, what do you have? The things that would most interest you are our weapon merchant, Anzeron, the leader of our militia. Akari is still around here somewhere, too. He sells droid components. Uh, what exactly? We hope it will become the new center of government for the settlers. The administrator has been trying to organize us in the wake of the Jedi Civil War. Not a very big building. We're a small group of settlers on the edge of Republic space. The building isn't large, but it's only the beginning. Just go to the central corridor and make a right. Here's okay. Gotta go. Are you waiting for the administrator too? You won't have to wait too long. But if you want results... Why not? is like a droid without his power cell. Useless. We have problems all over, and the most you can get out of the administrator is a pat in the back. I'm sick of all their excuses and empty words. I need justice now. I fought in the war, and I know how to use my blaster rifle. If the administrator or Zeron doesn't do something, then I will. And what's the problem? Salvagers are the problem. They strip bare the ruins that belong to the people of Dantooine. Then they sell what they find back to us at inflated prices. I'm not a violent man. I've had my share of it in the war. I sincerely hoped I could just hang my blaster rifle on the wall as a souvenir for my grandchildren. But I can't farm without my equipment. They stole your oh, equipment? Yes and no. I brought my moisture vaporator to Kunda to be serviced. On the way back to my farm, I took a shortcut next to the Enclave ruins. Damn legrics came out of nowhere. I had to run before they made a meal of me. When I returned to retrieve my equipment, the salvagers had already stripped it bare. No. Oh. Sure it's My farm is the closest to the Enclave ruins. It has to be someone nearby. And if the mercenaries wanted it, they'd just take it in broad daylight. 
The closest place besides that is the salvager camp, so it has to be them. You ever met one of them? Thievery wouldn't be too far a stretch for any of them. Hmm. The other day I had to take a shot at one of them. Soon someone is going to get killed, and Dantooine has enough trouble without that. Will they steal? A lot of farming equipment. It's not even valuable, just important for the moisture vaporators and the hydro processors. The thief must be desperate for credits. Anything I can do? I suppose you could. Actually, you almost look like a salvager. If you could go to this salvager camp and convince the salvager Joran to return my modulator, I would be very grateful. I'm not rich, but I have some souvenirs from the war I could give you. All right. Where is it? It's right next to the ruins of the Jedi Enclave. I'll see what I can That's do. You okay? What brings you to Kunda? Do you have any troubles to report? I'm here to help. I just hope you aren't here about Garavik. Garavik? Oh, sorry. If you're brand new to these parts, you may not have any issues with Garavik. Unlike most everyone else. Who? You're fortunate not to know him. He's a salvager. His purpose in life seems to be causing us headaches. I can tell he's back in Kunda just by the pounding in my head. If you're not here about Garavik, do you have some other problem? Uh, I got no problems. You haven't? Well, that's something. I'm the second in command over here, and we keep getting incidents. Our staff is stretched thin. Too thin. If you do have trouble, I'm not the one to talk to. You need to talk to Zeron. He takes a hands-on role as the militia captain. Yeah. Uh, this is sensitive. It's not really a secret, though. A lot of people are upset with Zeron. He's a hard man and doesn't answer to anybody. Except, I suppose, the administrator. The thing is, he expects everyone to follow all the laws. That's not normally a bad thing. But the mercenaries are used to having a bit more freedom. So, it's like Zeron keeps prodding a ranker with a stun stick. To a ranker, it's just a minor nuisance. But if you keep at it, he's gonna fight back. Mm. The mercenaries aren't unreasonable. They're mostly just war veterans looking for work. But Zeron just keeps poking them. So he has to get involved to make sure that the militia does what he wants. Otherwise, we'd probably give the mercenaries some room. Uh, can anyone do it's anything tricky. about it? You see, I think Zeron may be taking this whole thing a little personal. I I'm not sure. Just a guess. Hmm. I also think he's doing more to provoke them than just investigating every complaint against them hard. He's up to something. If someone could just ask a few questions, turn up some answers, maybe see if Zeron isn't being completely honest with the rest of us, well, then maybe he should be replaced. Now, what can just I do? Just look around. See if Zeron's up to something on the side. Something that'll hurt the fragile peace we got with the mercenaries. Hmm. So if you happen to find something out like that, you should see Administrator Adare. If you have to do some footwork to check into things, you'll be compensated. We should probably talk about something else. I hate going behind the captain's back. I just feel... Uh, I just have a feeling about it. Hmm. Well, we've got a feeling about something else. The end of an episode. So for today, I'm Sippy. I'll see you guys then.